Hey guys, how are you? It's Layla here and today I'm going to be going back to the basics and I'm going to be teaching you guys how to create a regular French braid all the way in the back. So if you still don't know how to do it or if you just want to touch up on your technique, then keep watching and I will take you through all the steps. So to master the French braid, all you really need is a lot of practice just and just a few basic tools like a brush to comb through the hair as your first step and then just a small elastic at the end to um, tie in your braid and then at the end some hairspray if you have any flyaways or anything like that so that's pretty much all we need and the first thing I'm going to do is just brush all the hair backwards so for the rest of this tutorial I'm going to turn around and do it backwards and try to give you guys um, easy directions that you can follow so here we are I'm starting off with my hair that has been brushed thoroughly and what I'm going to do is just pick up a section of hair going from uh, all the way at the front where your bang area is all the way towards your crown area and you want to just separate that from the rest of your hair and divide that into three sections once you have this divided into three sections all you want to do is um, crisscross the hair so the left this is my left and this is my right and this is the center the left's gonna go over the center and then the right's gonna go over the center so here is the left over the center and here's the right over the center so once we have this first um, beginning of the braid all you want to do is grab sections from the sides and keep adding them to the sides so here is my right so what I'm going to do is grab a section of hair just with your finger from the very front like this and just add that to your right side we're gonna hold it tight and then we're going to do exactly the same thing on the left side so we're just gonna pick up with your finger strand and just add that to your left side so once you have that hair added in you're just gonna grab it and just bring that over the center strand like that and then now this is the center so we're gonna bring the right over the center as well so here we go we're gonna just bring that over so now that we have the hair added in, we're gonna hold it tight and basically keep doing the same exact thing. So I'm gonna add some hair from the side right here to my right section. I'm gonna hold tight the center and then do the same thing over here. Hold it tight and then bring that over the center again. So here we go, we got our second part done. And basically at this point, you just wanna keep going. Just hold it everything really tight and keep doing the same exact thing. We're gonna keep adding hair here, like that with our finger to the right side. We're gonna separate the hair, hold it tight, hold the middle tight, and then we're gonna add more hair here on the side, add it into our left side, bring that over the center, hold it tight, bring the right over the center, cross them together, just make sure everything is tight. And then again, we're going to just grab section of hair from the side, bring that over and add it to your right side, hold tight, bring section of hair from your left side, and just add that into your left section, hold everything tight, bring it over the center, and basically at this point you want to just keep going and adding hair until you get to the nape of your neck, and then I'm going to turn around and finish off with a braid. So once you've finished braiding in the back, at this point when you reach the nape of your neck, all you want to do is just finish off with a regular three strand braid. So I'm going to braid that all the way to the end and just secure that with a small elastic band. So at this point once you have secured the end of the braid, you're pretty much done. If you have flyaways like me or like baby hair, all you want to do is just apply a little bit of hairspray just to smooth it all down, just like that, and then I'm going to smooth it all down. So that's it you guys, once you have smoothed down the hair, this is done, the French braid is done. All you gotta do is practice, practice, practice if you don't get it from the first try. It's a um, very simple technique, but something that takes a while to get for some reason, even for me when I was first learning it. So here you are, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you don't get it again, just keep watching the technique until you get it and keep practicing. And if you do recreate the look, then I use a hashtag um, Luxie Hair on Instagram and share with us for your chance to be featured on our Luxie Hair Instagram account. And the link for that will be in the bottom bar or you can just search Luxie Hair. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.